uh, theme as you can see we have given some underwater theme and that's what it has generated uh, we can add more if we want right and play with characters as you can see it has uh, Imagine you've got a cool idea for a game. Maybe something like Subway Set First Meet Zombie or a chill puzzle game where Indian street food gives you power-ups. Sounds fun, right? But there is also not so fun part in it. You need a concept, you need assets, a game design document, and maybe even a prototype. And that's where most game ideas die, even before it starts. Welcome to day 189 of the 1000 days of no code challenge. Today we are checking out Ludo AI. Yes, that's what they named it, Ludo. Anyways, Ludo is an AI powered tool that gets your ideas to life. From brainstorming to design documents and even prototypes all in one place. So let's jump in and see how it works. So to begin, head over to ludo.ai and we can click on try for free which will open up for registration and we can start with sign in with google use the account and click on continue and so we have brainstorming concept development market insights asset creation so these are the four things that we can use ludo for okay. as you can see we have game concepts playable generator we have favorites idea pathfinder game ideator ask ludo this is where you can ask ludo for something related to game. And we have asset creation, which is uh, image generation or 3D asset generation aspect. Uh, finally, we have market trends. We can search for a few things within Ludo and top chart blender. So we'll start with the uh, game ideator. It all starts with brainstorming and we will add underwater city defense, right? So I will click on this one and we can add some filters like uh, what is the genre like hyper casual casual core action adventure and so on and so forth let's say adventure hyper casual i don't know whether both can go hand in hand uh we can make it as board game uh and then platform is mobile desktop web let's go with mobile uh art style whether it is uh low poly or uh, photorealistic 3d cartoonish, whether we want uh, voxel art and so on and so forth. There are a lot of options available or even also click on any style and uh, perspective. Again, you have first person, third person, over the shoulder, top down, isometric and so on and so forth. I'll leave it any perspective. And finally, we can click on start new generation. So what it does is it generates three ideations for us. Bubble blast defense, uh, echoes of the deep city, substructure tactics, right? Uh, you can ask Ludo regarding anything or even click this and it will show you what is the details of that particular game, right? Um, click this one and you see that uh, the score is 2 out of 10. For this one, it is 3 out of 10. And for this one, it is 2 out of 10. Hmm. Strange, right? And it also gives you the details of uh, the game. A hyper casual game where players rapidly tap to inflate and burst defensive bubbles protecting a city from abstract underwater threats right and then some more description about it it also gives you some uh, similar training games like journey sky uh, this is children of the light and this is also children of the light um, yeah and then similar games which is uh, soda bubble defender eye bubble burst and bubble dust right you can click on uh, these three you can check out and whatever you like, you can click on create concept. Okay. I love bubble. So let me go with bubble <laughs> and click on create concept. Right. Now it's asking you uh, choose a template, whether you want default or whether you want essential, which has mechanics, objectives, theme, playable characters, art, gameplay, 3D assets, which requires three credits or uh, you want a rapid prototype, which is 0.5 credits and so on and so forth, right? Or you want custom sections where you will select what is required and based on which it will generate, right? I'll go with uh, this one, Essential, which seems to be the best one amongst all, or it has more details. So I'll click on this one and it will take some time to generate the entire details. 
so it's generating the description and 3d assets rest of the things are already done okay as we can see here we've got the mechanics so pattern pulse threat and bubble shield formation so there are two uh, mechanics already created we can also add more mechanics to it uh, we have objectives which is defeat the apex swarm we can add more objectives if you want or we can also ask ludo and brainstorm even further uh, theme as you can see we had given some underwater theme and that's what it has generated uh, we can add more if we want right and playable characters as you can see it has uh, added one character if you want you can add more to it and uh, the art we can add some text over here which is optional if you want we can add more art okay and gameplay as we can see that uh, this is how it looks like right when you start playing the game so basically uh, you can see that we are supposed to uh, break this threats or uh, hit on it uh, which is when you you get scores right there are two patterns that it has created if i'm not wrong right and uh, you can choose uh, whatever you like right and download it uh, there's uh, one 3d asset that has got uh, generated um, i'm not really sure where we can use this but yeah and we can create multiple 3d assets as well if you want you can also see some trending games which has been uh, popular amongst users now we can also go to uh, playable generator right and uh, create new and is it uh, pixie.js 2d or uh, 3.js which is 3d let's go with uh, 2d describe your game so we can give our uh, prompt here a casual runner game where the player is dabbawala in mumbai dodging traffic and collecting lunch boxes okay that's very interesting let's see send it playable so it's writing some javascript for us so there you go the game is ready i am collecting the lunch boxes and i'm not supposed to hit the vehicles coming on the road can i collect this oh no oh <laughs> let's restart one more game lunch box yo oh yeah there you go it's fun i can't stop it ah i can pause it okay i hope you had fun watching it too okay so that's ludo ai for you honestly it's not some magic button that can build your dream game overnight but it helps you in getting started you know that early stage where idea is fun in your head but overwhelming when you have to put it on paper ludo helps you with exactly that part it's an excellent tool for students solo developers or literally anyone who wants to bring their ideas of games to life without getting stuck figuring out game plan assets and much more from scratch and yeah it won't replace the entire dev team but it will save hours at the early stage and maybe give you something to play with so yeah if you have got some fun game idea in your note app then give ludo a shot and if you know any other ai tools meant for testing games or building one share it in the comments below i am always open to explore more thank you for watching and i will see you in the next one